Hello people of YouTube, it's Deepak here. Welcome to DCS 2.8.6 and welcome to Sinai. Seems to be running just fine for me in 2D at least. Uh, and that was quite close to a bunch of buildings. Go up and over the top. Um, this is in uh, northern Egypt, uh, so you can see that this is much more green than uh, some parts of the map. It's not just a desert map, we do have quite a variety of terrain types here. And uh, yeah, density of buildings is impressive. This is not something I've seen uh, much on DCS maps. A little bit in some parts of Syria, in Turkey, but this is even beyond what we've seen in Turkey. There's a lot of stuff going on here. And I think if I power on, it will make our way to the coast. So I'll see if I can show that to you all as well. To gain some altitude. I'm in the Razbam M2000C just now, simply because I've been using this for filming during the course of the day. So I thought I would stick to what I was already using. A uh, quick look at the F10 map so you can see what it all looks like. This is, you know, pretty much the extent of it. Uh, we've got we've got Egypt, we've got, I guess this is Jordan? Yeah, we've got Jordan, maybe. And uh, Israel. So, yeah, uh, some bits and bobs to play around with. Yeah, I'm actually not quite as far north as I thought I was. It might take me a little bit of time to get there. Instead, let's go east, because there's some interesting stuff to see out east. In the form of the Suez Canal. Some more buildings to whiz past. Let's do a bit of that. Go and do this without killing myself as well, because... It's going to be difficult to, to pull up at these speeds, but no, we made it. But I guess that's the Suez Canal, is it? No, that's not the Suez Canal. What nonsense am I talking? I'm nowhere near it. It's over here. Uh, yes, we keep flying this way, we'll find it. My uh, Egyptian geography is not the best. Nope, oh, we've got a... Got a caution. What's our caution? Configuration. Oh, okay, we burned some fuel. That's fine. Let's get that fixed. Now we'll have a bit more maneuverability. So yeah, we should be there shortly. In fact, I think I can even see it. I assume that is the canal over there. But yeah, it, my frames have been fantastic. I think it looks really good. Uh, these are my normal settings, so, you know, the exact same thing you've seen in all of my videos. Nothing particularly uh, exciting or unusual here. Um, and yeah, definitely in 2D. Not tried it in VR yet. Uh, that'll be a whole different challenge. I'll do that later. But I thought that perhaps you would all appreciate this uh, first impression. This is literally the first time I'm firing up this map. I've not even seen it before. And big shout out to Pink Floyd, uh, member of Deep Hack's ground crew. He donated this map to me, uh, so I, I haven't paid for this. Uh, you know, full disclosure, this was paid for by Pink Floyd, so thank you very much indeed. That's exceptionally kind. Well, there's even a bridge here. Well, you know what has to happen now. I'll maybe do that as my big finale. See, even speaking French while flying the French aircraft. Uh, let's see if we can do this. Uh, I'm in uh, I'm in the normal air-to-air -air limitations mode, so it should be possible for me to pull enough G's to do this. Oh, look, the detail in in these settlements is impressive. Let's just pop it under here. And over the top. Hopefully not pass out on the way. Get the... Get the speed down this time. And maybe try going this way. Oh. There we go. We got it. 
that big delta wing at high angles of attack is really acting as an air brake. Let's uh, take it a little bit more carefully here. There we go, that's what I was trying to do. Can we do this without dying? Yes, we can. Woohoo! Alright, let's uh, actually let's just fly along the length of the canal for just a little bit and get a feel for what this looks like. I'm actually not familiar with the Suez Canal in real life. Um, but I guess it probably looks something like this. Get that altitude down. I'm still at about 300 feet radar altimeter. It's getting nice and low. Some civilian traffic there on the access road at the side. little suggestive arrow in the middle of the HUD. You might want to pull up now. That'd be nice. Very, very low. Very nice transonic effects there as well. Very, very tasty. Hopefully there's not something in front of me that I've not seen yet. <laughs> Wow, that's really cool, actually. Some really nice uh, bridges and other infrastructure. Uh, and all these settlements as well. Yeah, very, very nice. I'm rather impressed by this. And uh, yeah, like I said, no no real sign of poor performance. This is this is running like an absolute dream for me. Uh, really nice frame rates. Uh, I wonder, can I even bring up the little counter? Yes, I can. Yeah, so you can see I, I'm basically hitting the frame rate cap most of the time. Uh, up there, altitude, I was about 180. Down here, it's trending more towards about 100. Um, oh, actually, lower, in fact. More like 90. But that's that's plenty. This still looks very, very good. I'm going to hit a building if I'm not careful. Uh, but, uh, oof, these cranes came out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, this is why you don't do this in real life. And especially, if you're going to do this, don't do it at this kind of speed. Uh, I'm currently supersonic, flying over built-up areas and manoeuvring hard. I'm surprised the aircraft is actually maintaining supersonic while I pull these maneuvers. Mirage is rather impressive. Uh, this is with two 530s, two Magics, uh, the Eclair pod, and one fuel pod, although that fuel pod is now empty, I believe. But, uh, yeah, oh, chimneys, we know what we have to do here. This might be the end of me. No, we made it! Oh, that was a bit of a clencher. Very, very nice indeed. Okay, I think I'll close it out here. I've done enough fooling around. But for those of you who haven't seen much of Sinai in action, don't know what to expect. Uh, like I said, this is my very, very first, very early impressions. I think it looks brilliant. I think it looks really good. Uh, so, yeah. If you haven't already, please subscribe, like, and comment. It's a really big help to me and to the channel. You also have the option of further supporting the channel by joining DeepHack's Ground Crew. You can do that for a small monthly fee by pressing the Join button below. Big shout out to those of you who've already done so. Thank you very much, Harish Rajan, Byron Farrow, Storm Kambari, Channel Wright, Mangash, JR Walker, Chandler Hedgevald, Griff Nizzle, Mr. Yeti, Frantic Stone, Bread, Tier Zero, Erdinkertan, Veli Tapani Corpicanas, Tiger Moto, Sean IM81, Charts, and Pink Floyd. And big thank you to Pink Floyd for providing the map. See you all later.